Thursday, Harry Rilling stood outside Tracy's school and talked about his vision for Norwalk's education system. The Democrat running for mayor says more than anything, he wants to work with teachers. Teachers need to have input. The people who are actually doing the job in the classroom, they need to feel that they're respected. They need to feel that they have input into the operation of the school system because they're the people that are doing the job. I would be very positive about that. Norwalk Federation of Teachers President Bruce Mellian says he listened to Rilling Thursday to hear his message and keep Norwalk's teachers informed. I think that's really important that they're aware of that information. He says he likes what he heard. They just want to be heard. They want to be listened to. They want to be appreciated for the work they do because they do work really hard. They come in early, they stay late, and they do a lot of things extra. If they're doing the job, they know where the problems are, where the problems lie and they need to be a part of the solution and have a seat at the table, have a voice. Over the last eight years, when the current mayor has been in place, the difference between what the Board of Ed has requested of the city and what the city finally allocated is $26.5 million. That averages out, averages out to a reduction of $3.3 million per year. That has really um, been an impact an impact on certified employees, an impact on non-certified employees, an impact on the work that uh, we have to do. Rilling says he will also push to improve early childhood education and set up a line of apprenticeships well, for with, high uh, school students. I've, I've spoken to the Carpenters Union, um, who uh, also works with uh, plumbers and electricians and masons and other unions that are clamoring for young people to enter uh, an apprenticeship program. Mike Peel, it's relevant.com.